Yep, Steve's here now with an update on your forecast, Steve. It's all a matter of good timing, you know. We got the rain when a lot of us could handle it, what rain that fell. And then for the rush hour, we're okay. And I think if you got plans for going out this evening, I don't think you'll find any rain. But then be prepared tomorrow and in the afternoon and the evening. And then after that on Friday, it gets a little bit more intense as well. So they're coming in rounds. And as I make my rounds around the weather watchers, I can see just from glancing at the map that it's somewhat cooler by the lake and a little bit milder if you head westward. Let's see what Patrice is saying. She checks in from the West Loop every day. Comfortable in the West Loop this evening. No rain is falling, so maybe you're waiting for someone to uh, get home from uh, the lakefront area. Let's see what's going on here in Grundy County. Uh, Kennedy, he says it's 74 degrees there. Some early rain this morning, but didn't get the amount that we need. That's the problem. Uh, the rain fell. It looked promising, but I don't think uh, most people got the kind of rainfall that was significant. What happened in Indiana? Cheryl and Mike in Rensselaer. Temps have fallen 13 degrees since 3 o'clock, so the dew points at 62. It's comfortable outside and it's cool enough for a jacket after being near 80 degrees in some places this afternoon. Let's move on. Talk about the rest of this weather story. Uh, we know that uh, tonight we're OK. It's in the bag. It's a partly cloudy night. Uh, nice and comfortable. Uh, dew points are low. Look at that almanac. 76 degrees. That was the official temperature and that was a good deal above what's normal for this time of year. It's 67, 65. That was the coolest temperature we had in this time of year. We ought to be uh, dressing for weather that's in the 40s when you wake up in the morning. I don't see anything like that coming anytime soon. Right now at a 72 at Midway, 74 degrees officially at O'Hare. And just like the weather watchers had mentioned, from north to south shore Chicago, you're going to find some slightly cooler temperatures in the 60s. But look to the west, cooler than that out in Minneapolis and around Iowa. That weather's coming our way, so we know that eventually we're going to get some 60s for highs. Uh, these are the temperatures we expect between 8 and midnight night tonight between 60 and 65 degrees. Let's get back to the rainfall potential. We know it's coming again tomorrow. I think before midnight tomorrow it won't be again that much, maybe a half inch of rain in some spots. It's after that during the morning and the afternoon on Friday. That's when we have the potential to get more than an inch of rain in many locations. If that comes through, a lot of folks are going to be feeling good about that after it's been so dry. So uh, rain chances for the rest of this week with the temperature Temperatures closer to normal. You're trying to figure out your weekend. It looks like showers off and on on Saturday and then sunny and warmer weather, at least in the mid 70s again on Sunday afternoon. So the better of the two days weather wise is Sunday showers and the thunderstorm possible, especially early in the day on Saturday. So at the moment uh, we've got the rain showers that are continuing to move away from us. Maybe Newton and Jasper holding on to just a few showers. That's a cold front that's come through. Brand new weather system trying to clear the air, but this front comes back at us, and that's the reason why we're expecting that rain. Here's just a hint. I don't think we're going to have any flood watches, but uh, in one part uh, of the system west of it, you can see the areas that have some flood watches in effect. That's the potential for some pretty heavy rain as that warm front moves this way. But for the next 24 hours, cloudy and cool for the first part. Remember, as that front gets uh, closer, that's when we get the greater risk of rain tomorrow. So tonight we'll just play it cool. 56 degrees for the overnight low, maybe a few degrees cooler in some places. Uh, nice weather for the weekend, but look at a 69 on Friday. I'm not hiding it, but I am just want to reveal it slowly. <laughs> oh, look at next Wednesday with a little luck. We'll have a high of 60. That's how cool and October like the weather will eventually get around here. It looks like next week is the week for that to happen. Yes, very fall like yes, there. Yes, indeed. Thank you, Steve.